Hello and welcome to Engineering Tech Tutor, Key Stage 2, States of Matter. So, materials, they have three main states. These are solid, liquid and gas. Now it's possible for materials to change between all three of these states very simply by using heat. If we apply heat to a solid, we get a liquid. If we apply further heat to that liquid, it will turn into a gas. If I then cool the gas down, I can turn it back to a liquid. And if I then further cool that liquid, I can then turn it back into a solid. So materials are made up of particles. If I was to look at this little orange block under a microscope, I would find that it actually looks like this. It actually looks like a lot of tiny little balls or shapes all held very closely together. All materials are made up of particles. The types of particles depend on what material we're looking at, but we won't cover that today. So in solids, the particles that make up the material are so closely packed together that they cannot move. This gives the solid a stable shape and volume. They can only change shape when they are cut or when they are hit. Solids cannot be compressed. So liquids are actually quite like solids. The particles that make up the material are still closely packed together, but unlike a solid, they can move relative to each other. This means that liquids don't have a stable shape. They spread out to fill the container they are in. However, just like a solid, a liquid cannot be compressed. And so our final state is gas. A gas is a liquid that can be compressed. A gas does not have a fixed shape or volume. In fact, as a liquid warms up and turns into a gas, it expands and fills up the entire void that it's sitting in. And it will do that until the whole container is full. If there was not a lid on the container, the gas would spread out into the atmosphere and it would be entirely lost. Well, thanks for watching this very short tutorial on the states of materials. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you learned something from it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and we'll see you on the next show.